Oh. Do you guys want to introduce someone? Welcome everyone to Portal Glitchless by myself, Sayo, and Insomnia. We got Rippy and Club who are on the couch, two much better players. <laughs> um, so I guess we'll just launch into it because we've got like a minute at the start. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. Someone do the countdown. countdown. Yeah. Okay. So let's get it started in three, two, one, go. <laughs> let's go. I got faster, Luke. Straight into a cutscene. We love it. So I might talk about the basic movement tech. Um, in Portal, uh, Valve kind of fixed an exploit that used to be in the game, where if you just continuously jumped, you used to get speed. Called B-hopping. Yeah, B-hopping. We still call it B-hopping, but it's not the same old B-hopping. Basically, when you land, you get given negative speed to take you back to the speed cap. Again, well Can be used here to get some funny glitches. Not going to be seen here. But yeah, so you want to be jumping as fast, well, as often as you can, not touching the ground for as long as possible, because your max speed will be in the air. Nice, nice flip. <laughs> and yeah, I'm not sure if we'll be seeing air strafing, but that's just minimal time gain, because every time you touch the floor, you will get your speed reset. We should explain that this is actually a glitchless run. So if yeah. you see in a portal run, you might see them shooting portals through walls, no clipping through stuff. There's a lot of weird shooting in portal 80% uh, inbounds and out of bounds, but this is glitchless and the game is still just as broken pretty much. So we start going, let's go! Yeah! Um, I can only hear Sire's game. You need Sire's game. <laughs> so we're out of the vault into the classic cube on Please button puzzle. Into the that was after. super hard Completing and I'm glad you both got it because I was stuck on there for an hour. <laughs> this game is like super backloaded. The, the first like 10 chambers are relatively really straightforward and even some of the ones in like the last sort of, it's basically like 1 through 15 are both really like straightforward. And the escape is just so backloaded and so fast yeah. in terms of like what needs to be done. This one's really tough too. Once we actually get the dual portal device, it's it's all over for the game. Yeah, a lot of people complain that like after 19, the difficulty ramps up a lot. And that's, that's kind of like a major time loss for a lot of new runners and even a lot of experienced runners. Like you'll see that the 19 to EO2 is vastly inferior compared to like the world record holder yeah yeah which is like 14 minutes 50 something yeah it's, yeah. it's insane Sidious. right now yeah very very Sidious strong. is just the goat at the game and we are just normal people like mortal humans yeah so this is a is a waiting time if we have anything to say i think it's a good time absolutely we've had a series of donations come through for this uh we have 20 dollars from nikasa that says glass core is my absolute favorite n64 game and i'm really chuffed to see it featured here at pax thank you so much for running it sandshark good luck sire and may for portal we have $10 from GoSynths with no comment. We do have $5 from Lim that says, May, by the way, I put a macro on the keyboard that has the game for you. If you press Alt F4. <laughs> Got time for more? Uh, yeah, go ahead. Yep. We have $20 from David that says, Portal 2 was the first game I fell in love with. Best of luck with Portal. Okay, so we've now got access to the portal gun, and would you know it, the game's named Portal. So you can use portals to get across. When you can, using portals is often the quickest form of travel, uh, because you can pretty much traverse great space instantly. Whenever we cannot do that, you'll see the, the bunny hopping pretty much. Yeah. Um, those ones are just pretty easy introductory portal gun. Just shoot a portal, walk through it. But now we're combining the elements. Can you believe we've got a Cuban button and a portal puzzle? Oh, sorry, nice, nice night. <laughs> I got that. I got that in practice yesterday, and I was very happy. Sometimes the momentum of the button falling can just land it on the button for you, and then you can just rather than going and fixing it up, you just head straight for the door. Going for the IL strats right there. Yeah. We're pretty much, pretty much things. We're both in the elevator. Yeah. This is. A close race already. Still could be anyone. Yeah. Though. It's clearly the load time difference. Okay, <laughs> so five, we're gonna put two cubes on two buttons, and yep. Oh. Just having a little bit of difficulty game for that portal, and snipe the shot. Nice. nice. Yeah, you can shoot for that um, that door to just stop like the travel time, and as we said, shooting portals is often quicker than walking. Yep. Good job. 
As part of a required test protocol, so, yep, we will 05 is a bit more of a wait if we have anything else. <gasps> you yeah, the radio. Absolutely. We have $50 yeah. from Anonymous that says Spira Green, uh, which kind of on that note, um, if you do have any donations, we do have Bear With A Shotgun still matching for the next two thousand dollars i give or take two and uh, one and a half thousand uh, dollars any donations that are done online will be matched and doubled um to a total of five thousand uh, which will bring us up to the, the ten thousand mark which would be fantastic and if you do want to include any incentives in your donations uh please when you go to donate with it, either donate.ozspeedrunners.com or exclamation mark donate in the Twitch chat or the QR codes if you want to include a message for the incentive of your choice. So we're coming up to like a pretty big, I remember this is the first real skip of the game where you're trying to go through a portal. Is portal funneling on? So you, you, you do kind of want it on. So in some you just got to go, oh, oh you didn't put the, uh, the portal portal high enough. Yeah, that's too high. You want it a little bit lower? Yeah, you'll hit the CA. Uh, we'll see. Oh. So this one you want to try and get through without your feet touching the portal because you need the momentum to carry through. And the there we go. Nice. Sony, you got it. Dude. Are required on all mobile and I should also mention that you saw this orb. Um, yeah, we don't like solving orb and puzzles or orb and catcher puzzles. Oh, I was so close. And also with the with the orb, the energy orb. If you touch it, you actually do die. So we yeah. are now are getting hazards in the game. Um, in a future level, we'll be getting uh, 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 water hazards. So this one is actually a really interesting skip because we'll be using a piece of the wall geometry to. Yeah, so got hit by the energy orb there. I give up. Um, <laughs> The bit of the wall to just jump to the end. It's a bit of a hard uh, skip because you do have to jump off as you're like leaving a portal. And somebody oh, nice. that was a, that's a pretty hard skip to do. I gave up on mine. That's all right. I don't blame you. <laughs> um, back I don't know the way to do the room intended. <laughs> that's, a, that's all right. You did it. I don't think I can play Portal correctly anymore either, so... We so, we've got Sire coming out to this puzzle. Ooh, ooh, going for the fast track, jumping over to the platform again. Uh, we've, got the, no! we've got the blue Portal free shot, which is nice. Oh. And we've got Insomnia over here on 09. This, uh... So one of the skips in this level in the uh, any of Send is you have to shoot a portal under that door, and you're able to, like, jump through it, not using, uh the actual cube and in my opinion that's not a glitch and i'm mad that that's defined as it is a very hotly debated topic in the portal community even still yeah. um because the it just like doesn't have the right like excluding like yeah. you, it doesn't exclude that you can shoot portals on it for whatever reason so you can just like get in through the like through the bottom of the portal and through the top but how long so in some ways on the uh, the momentum puzzle this is when the game teaches you that speedy thing goes in speedy thing goes out and we actually normally you do have to do some of these jumps once or twice yep. so at that point you actually have to do a jump twice but if we start on the ground we actually have enough momentum to go through it just immediately rather than having to stop walk back and jump again yeah because you have to look at these platform or these these side walls that come out very slowly and yep. just skipping that it saves a bunch of time yeah some of this uh Hello the waiting again. this game is also just waiting for things to Reading reach the right uh the position and actually somnia is coming up to the fuel portal to device I have forgotten. Mm. Mm. it's up to you if you want to load a save or wait for cycle yeah you can probably have to oh no well, chance for Sire to catch up. So this room is normally like a lot of puzzles you have to do and a lot of waiting, but if you just you can just jump to it, similar to the uh, no, room gonna... before. I have to reload the uh, earlier save. Yeah, the auto save will probably oh, do it. Save, yeah. Might have to. Uh, you can type launch. in console load auto save if you want. Or just restart the map. Or is what that a uh, oh chance to catch up? I, I think oh. just wait on the cycle. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So this is, this is huge. That's alright, this, this is becoming nail biter now. So yeah, so some of these rooms do, when you do have the single portal device, you do have to wait for the cycle, so it's kind of imperative you get it quickly, but in this instance, you just have to wait. And yeah. Sire's caught back up. Oh, oh, and Sire's but there's a good well. save here. Sire has a good save. Uh, uh, just oh, press load. Yeah. Uh, 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 That's alright, there's still plenty of time to catch up. This should be. Keep going. And Sire's got the dual portal device. They've both got it now, so they're both pretty much neck next to the So the dual portal device, believe it or not, allows you to shoot two portals. So instead of the game being like, Yo, we don't think you're smart enough for the, the, the orange portal. What the? They have trust oh. in you now. 
So we're gonna see 12, and this is we're gonna be we're gonna oh, go to the middle platform here, and we're gonna try and yep. Oh, not quite, not quite. just just missed it. There's, there's an air strafe you can do. Um, we actually able to just go above to the next portal. So size not done it here, but it's just taking the safe strats. But I mean, safe strats win races. Yeah, so like they literally <laughs> they win marathons as well. Yeah, you know? yeah. <laughs> we might see Insomnia go for the strafe. Um, I forget how I did it. That's Ooh, yep. And then yep. Oh, almost. Oh, almost. That's okay. You have to go through like the very top. It's it's quite tricky. Yeah, and playing an unfamiliar territory exactly. here. Exactly. Like strafing on this is gonna be hard. I'll donate a hundred dollars if one of you tries oh, my to do throw. Oh, did you crash through that portal? Yeah. Yeah. So weird, weird little bug in portal. If you crash at the right time when you go through a portal, it just cancels out all your velocity. Ah, uh, no one did cube throw. So. Is you can actually throw the cube directly from that top platform, except it's so incredibly hard. It's really tough. Yeah, I've never gotten it, it once. I've never gotten it. I've done it in marathons here before. Oh, <laughs> look at this. We can't all be ready. <laughs> <laughs> so we've got a Siren 13 now. There's actually, by taking this cube from the first room, you can pretty much skip the second cube in this by just all oh, that all oh, that all oh, try to ruin your day. You just shoot a portal through the final room because the walls are portalable, and you do not need the second cube. The, um, when you do this like room very smooth and like super quickly, you actually finish the room before Kana uh, says uh, that the room will take a long time, you're actually over yeah. the <laughs> so I always find that funny. And this is probably one of the biggest skips in the game, because 14 is normally a really long chamber, but if oh. you just, you, uh, yes. you can just get a little bit of momentum and fling off the ground, and onto this final platform here. I'm not going the way, that I'm not going where I think I'm about to go. We're going to see Insomnia like try to re-portal. There we go. Uh, That's all right. There's plenty of backups, and you can try it again. Pretty much the whole room ahead is a full backup portal. Yeah, you can pretty much just put a portal on the roof and then use that to get your momentum if you so wish. Oh, you do it, okay, you do it that way. All right. Yeah. The, so we're gonna go for the backup here, and this is actually you might want to be closer to the elevator. Yeah, because I don't even know where I'm yeah. looking. And this is actually Val knew about this when they. Well, I don't know if they designed this room with this knowledge, but the portal does have a challenge mode built in. Yeah. And I believe the fastest to get the goal time for this room, you actually have to do this strat. The developer commentary actually mentions that they, like someone in playtesting, skipped that room. And they thought the solution was creative enough to let, like, leave it in. Yeah. So, but I think we should talk about Siren 15 here, because... Oh, this isn't my favorite. This straight here, if you just... Whoa, you just fling yes. around. Yeah, nice. Um, that 15 puzzle is a little bit weird. Um, I hated it casually, just because it doesn't work all the time. But we're going to see yeah. some more. Oh, oh, not that's all right, we can back okay. this up. Yeah. So we're going to skip solving the orb catcher. Um, the one that you do solve in the glitches throughout, we would have seen earlier in this chamber, which Whoa. Insomnia is currently solving. Yeah. But this one you can skip just by jumping off here, keeping momentum, and strafing around. Whoa. Oh, I don't know if we've actually explained what strafing is. Oh, strafing is moving left or right throughout the air, just pressing the uh, oh, yeah. A or D keys. Yeah. And you're able to, like, uh, if anyone's familiar with the Valve games here and Source games, just strafing is such an integral part of the movement in those games where you can just move through the air. Yeah, basically you gain extra speed and by moving your mouse in the same direction as you're moving. Um, we're up to 16 on side side, and it looks like we are setting up Spider-Man. This is kind of a more recent strat, I'd say last few years. Um, before my time. <laughs> so, but after my time. We, we set up here because it is easier to go fast when you do not need to worry about Tara. So we're going to keep shooting. Um, this shot is a little bit precise. Oh, nice. This whole room is very difficult. And by doing this, we can be fast about it, which is really cool. Um, there's a little break spot you can have here, and then we're just going to take out these turrets to secure the last room. Or the second last room, I guess. Um, interesting fact, you can press buttons with the turrets in this level. Yeah. Um, in Hammer, the engine that they they use to build the game, um, the turrets are named Box. And the NCB named Box is what allows the buttons to be pushed down. What the? That's very now, didn't it? Yeah. So yeah. So this room, like, is so hard to do. Where am I? <laughs> You're at the start. Yeah, but... Shoot. 
You want to be in the, that more left of the turret. Get, get off the wall, Spider-Man. Yep, there, and then you want to shoot. You have to walk forward a little bit, or on the edge, or move your portal. And so is up to the companion cube, and if you've played this game, you know you have to use this cube. Uh, three times to kind of complete uh, different puzzles. Yep. And we're not going to use any of them because whenever Portal gives us a physics object, we decide to use that physics object and yeah, to pretty climb much. out of the level. The so so is actually going to need to be unlucky. There's always a chance with the cycle you just get unlucky. Yeah, the, the way that the items interact with the orb is kind of a little bit of RNG in the run. Yeah. Um, there, there are, not again, not again, not again. There are steps we can take to mitigate that, but yeah. So we're going to see Saya go for the, the prop stack. Yeah. Um, this is what I told him. I don't know if there's new strats. There, there is a new strat in about the last year and a half, which is really cool. Um, I think we'll see Insomnia go for it, but it is a oh, hard yeah. strat to get. Um, I'm so lost. So I was just having fun stacking some uh, uh, camera and the companion. Oh, cube. that should still work. At least we're still using the companion um, cube as a oh. companion. So yeah, oh, it might be too low. Yeah, too yeah, low now. Too low. Yeah, oh, I go. I took a save. Yeah. save. Oh no! No! Oh no! Oh, oh, I thought I took a save later. The enrichment okay. center reminds okay, that's okay. you that the um, weighted no. companion cube so will never threaten to Basically, you want to get in. in fact, you want to shoot on the floor in between those two turrets so behind you? Yeah, there. On the floor. Yep. And shoot on that wall. Yep. That's right. Yeah, and yeah. then yeah. across there. Yeah. Yep. Across and then back. So the prop stack that Sayo is doing can be a little bit weird. Um, props keep going. Interacting uh, hard. Uh, the so, I just want to make note about Insomnia still doing 16. Is that this level when I went to learn it, I had to watch the video on like 0.25 speed and that's then what play I did the game I, on point. Uh, O one speed. Yeah. So it's like the amount of portals you have to do, you get lost so easily. So it's actually a really difficult level. You did it. I, I'd probably take the out the two other turrets in this room, to be honest. Yeah. I don't even know how to take However, out the other You shoot the camera at the top of the other one. Got time for a little fun fact? Yeah, I think go ahead. Fun fact. So I think for one of the first times, we actually have more people in the PAX crowd than we do on our Twitch chat. <laughs> so big props to the <laughs> PAX crowd here. Everyone. Thank you so much, everyone, for tuning in. So take out the turrets in that room that you're in, in some yeah. Just jump out of the portal and take yeah. out the two yeah. turrets too, right? I just want to skip the map, maybe. Yeah, if you want to skip it, we can do that too. Right. So size up to um, one of the closer, closer to the end levels. And Normally as well, if you played this, uh, you shoot have to go one closer this to you and the huge room. Shoot behind. Yep. But what we're going to do is we're actually going to grab the camera, camera. Shoot the camera. Do not destroy vital place oh, up against this door, and we're quickly going to go run over a button, and the camera is going to wedge the door open because the game lets us do that. And so they, they, it will oh. spit out the camera eventually. So so I have to be quick. Yeah, so there we yeah. go. I got stuck on something. I wasn't sure what it yeah. was. Okay, so nice. We're, we're, make sure you make a save. <laughs> <laughs> I got it. I got a camera. I three. That's awesome. That's really good. So this 18 section that Sire on is kind of... Oh, 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 oh no! <laughs> no! What? You basically keep a lot of momentum and you do a bunch of flings. Um, you okay, can good. do a re-portal to try and skip some. The re-portal so... I, I could never re-portal any of my runs, so I always just kept the safe strats. Yeah. That's why I don't speed around the game. It's a strat that... Is hard to learn for a very minimal time save. Oh, uh, yeah, because you're able to, if you do it properly, you're able to skip just one platform. Not like and this. And you have to then still be precise to land, to shoot a portal on the final platform just above, but it's yeah. so there difficult. Go. There we go, well, so I got it. Very nice. I've never had myself like moving sideways through that area. Uh, <laughs> I was having to like yeah. manually line back up. It, it seems like you don't have portal filing on. Oh, is that a what? Portal funneling being portal on or off? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Should it be on or off for speed? Ones? I think it's supposed to be on. A lot of people at high level will have toggles. Oh, right, okay. So, for context, portal funneling, yeah. basically, the developers found uh, players had trouble uh, landing in the portal. So, if you're near one with portal funneling on, it will actually funnel you into the portal. Just so, when you think you should make it, you will make it. Yeah. However, since that takes control away from, like, Sometimes we want to go through the portal on the edge. Um, the portal funnel will put us in the center, so we'll actually sometimes want it off, but more off. So. Yeah, so an example of that is 18, you really want it on. Um, 
But we're already at the, we're already at oh, the ending Spider scene, I even realize. The Spider-Man strat, very nice. <laughs> so uh, that was the whole chamber that I was yeah. talking over. So that used to be a task strat, and then a certain uh, portal member, I think it was Dino, and was like starting doing runs, and people realized, whoa, this is actually possible. Was, then, was that a glitch shooting through that pipe just there? No. No? No. Are you sure? No. Um, so that's another hotly debated topic, but we'll just say it is allowed in Wishlist. Um, it has been decided, and okay. we'll just leave it at that. They, the developers for, forgot to put uh, collisions on that port, on that uh, pipe, so you could just shoot straight through and skip another. Yeah, puzzle. that's not my fault though. It's very much what we'd call a map exploit, um, which people will be like, then why don't you allow the map exploit that is 09 shooting yeah. under the, the, the door? But that's what I'm saying. Well, if we're airing that one, let's speedrun rules are. Uh, very contested topic, and who am I to say what they are when people vote on them? So, so yeah, something yeah. I hear is trying to do the new 17 strat, and this is this is hard. Make sure you shoot the portal that you're coming out of first on the ground. Oh, my colors are flipped. Yeah, so you have to use orange first, and then blue, blue, and then you go oh for a fling to the end, and you can wow. shoot the portal behind. Nice. That, that one, that strat really there. Hard. I've never seen that now before. What colors out there? <laughs> There you go. Yeah, and then wow. you can grab the cube there. Um, you can also grab the cube on the fling to prevent this little bit here. What is but that? that's also, it can be a bit random with the cube drop, so this is pretty much safer. Now, so I have to just kind of climb through these different um, industrial areas. So this is the escape sequence, because we've broken out, broken free from GLaDOS, who's the, uh, I, I've, got, I've assumed people know what GLaDOS is. GLaDOS is the robot speaking and is kind of controlling everything we do and is testing us and she keeps on being mean to us so we're going to tell her, we're going to give her a piece of our mind. Yeah, basically we don't like robots. Um, yeah. We think they're taking away our freedom, um, which I mean, look, we've been confined in a vault for who knows how long. Yeah. Um, oh, cool little thing we can do here, by crashing into the bottom of this door, we don't need to shoot, we just need to e. Oh, there we go. And I then Oh. No, no! Oh, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. But the other door's working. Hi! <laughs> so, yeah, that's even scared. You can open that door earlier, because all three doors are meant to open before you can go through. But if you just crouch into that one, it just activates for whatever reason. And we've got Saya coming oh, up to. Oh, oh, wrong, wrong portal. portal. Yeah, we yeah. Good, good save though. What, good what save. was the skip? Is this the. This flippy... one's called the Flippy Skippy. The Flippy Skippy. Um, this. Oh, not quite. Not yeah, quite. I'm pretty sure portal piling is not on by the looks of things. Yeah, definitely not. <laughs> oh, I was close. Um, so the flippy skippy, the aim of it is to keep this turret alive. Because what would you know? The turrets were trying to kill you on 16, but we like to make friends with them. We believe that yesterday's enemy is today's friend. So we're going to grab this turret. And we're going to align in a position where it can break open these two pieces of glass in this next room. Because um, this rocket turret that shoots out is it's so slow. You it's so slow. You can also grab what I do is I grab the chair and if you put it on an angle and you throw it at the glass, it just breaks it. Yep, that, that is very true. But a lot of people do struggle with that because you're not allowed yeah. to do a thing called a super throw, which makes that strat a lot easier. Hopefully I haven't been doing super throws <laughs> in my run. Super throws are fairly easy to do. You just hold left click and then press E, which is normally the use. I haven't been doing that. Um, that makes that strat really easy, but... So yeah. coming up to... Uh, so I was coming up to a really... One of my favorite skips in the game, where I don't even know how it works exactly, but we skip another entire room. Basically, that's this whole game. Yeah, it, it's, it's Skip City in here. Yeah. And so he has to shoot... Uh, oh, it needs to be a bit higher than yeah, that. A bit yeah, higher. Very top. And he'll shoot a portal onto the other side of the room. Air strafe. Yeah. No, oh, I'm not doing that one. You're not doing that one? one. Uh, you didn't teach it to me properly. Oh, uh, you, you were able to do you it. You should have hit me up. For like <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm going to need to be higher. Oh, no. Do I need to be higher? No. Should be fine. Yeah, you can just shoot a portal on the, the yeah. ground there and you'll be fine. Yeah. I'm, I'm not going to make it, though. That's fine. You got the backup. Yeah, there we go. And then we're going to skip another section of this room by using this, this momentum that we can get from this jump. We can fling ourselves all the way to the top catwalk here. And yeah. There we go. Skips another section. So normally this room also, yeah, also will like fill with uh, turrets as like Gladys' last attempt to uh, thwart, uh, thwart Chell. But um, now we're in uh, Gladys' area. So just one more catwalk. And we, since we don't want to walk, we'll just use portals to get there. Because yeah. who wants to walk? 
And right now we're seeing Insomnia do the, the Spider-Man strats again. Um, oh, that falls oh, a little yeah. bit too high, so you cannot get the angle. Yeah, that's going to be better. There you go. So we're going to shoot on the second line over there, and then we can get this very precise shot. And so, and go back inside the... Yep. Way GLaDOS is defeated is that she has all these cores, uh, these cores which is what Clara has right now. Yep. And if we destroy all of them, GLaDOS will die. So they drop uh, on a sequence, well not a sequence, actually GLaDOS has to be damaged by what we're going to use a rocket here. In the glitched one, they're using Taro. Yeah, I don't think that's a glitch. Oh. I'll just... <laughs> but it's, it's, one of those, it's one of those things where, like, if you skipping the final boss feels bad in a glitchless category. Yeah, like, yeah that's true. So I, I just think it's a fun way to kill GLaDOS. You pull a turret from the room earlier and just shoot through the yeah. opening door. It's fun. Because GLaDOS but is just programmed if she takes damage, yeah. she'll output a core. So in the glitch runs, they just... Well, do they even do GLaDOS in the glitch runs? Or is it... Yeah, you, yeah. you still... You basically, when you get the turret to shoot her, all three cores come off. And you just... In the first phase, you just incinerate them all. I'm a little worried about my orange portal placement, but it should be Ooh, fine. It should be fine. The, uh, you got yeah, it. Good. You're good. So they, all the cores, when they do get destroyed, they go to these uh, set locations. They're not random locations, but they're still pretty out there. It's not like they drop to the ground. So that one was on a pipe. The next one will be on this platform way up high. And then the one after that is kind of just in mid-air. In mid like yeah. You have to fling yeah. to it. Um, there are some crazy optimizations you can do in the Gladys fight. Um, some of them I do not think are worth it, but people go for them and they hit them. So, <laughs> for, for that like half second of time save. But we're gonna see Sayo incinerating the cake core. But that one just tells you all about the recipe of how to bake a cake. It's I, I, I made it based on what it said, and it was a great cake, so I recommend everyone here make that cake as well. Yeah, that's alright. Oh, oh, no, I dodged it! Oh, that, that kind Shoot of stuff. him! That's alright, we can attempt again. We've still got plenty of time left until before the neurotoxin, which oh, is the no. big okay. time rest uh, yeah. I reckon I'm off center a little bit. Yeah, so as Gladys does get more and more damage, she moves a lot more, which there we go. Yeah, can mean that sometimes the, the rockets in this uh, setup misses. And we'll see on some of the screen, we're up to E01, which is the second last map of the game. Ending 01. Yep. yep. And then we... Very nice. Oh, the red core sire. Oh, oh. Did we get it? Yeah, okay, it. So that's it's gonna be time on sire. Time on sire, yeah. Ooh. Very nice. That was a very good run. That was a pretty good run. We're gonna see Flippy skip Not from bad. Insomnia over here. So yeah, we wanna get in and scrape around a little bit. And then we're gonna... I don't think that fall lands in the right place. Yeah, that's... Yeah, it's on like the back of the... You'd wanna crash down probably. Yeah, it's better. And then we're gonna grab this turret and we're gonna... Yeah, like I said before. Sometimes turrets are mean, sometimes they're friends. Really, it, turrets have different personalities. Ooh. And oh, oh got it. knocked over. And, uh, and we can't bring the turret into the next room because of the, the fizzler of it. It will just destroy the yeah. turret. So we got that. Oh, that bastard. And the ending cutscene. And then there's set up for Portal 2 here. Yeah. Yeah. Which took like 10 years to come out. <laughs> um, not, it that was long, not that long. Four years, right? Portal 1 was 2007 and Portal oh, 2, 2011. Hit by the rocket. It felt like 10 years. Yeah. Are we gonna Are we gonna sing the? No. I'm Song? gonna pass. No. Because it's it actually gets DMCA'd on Twitch. Oh god. Oh, oh stop it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Even though it, it's just one of those false claims, because Valve says people can use it, you can contest it, but many people have gotten their vods muted because of it. Oh god. So just, just like hit console when you get to the, the final part. Yeah. I think. E everyone can search up still gone. It's a still, uh, gone. still alive. Still gone. Still alive. Yeah. Man, I'm still gone. That's I thought what I'm saying. <laughs> um, still Dan alive. It's because I merged. Want you gone is the Portal yeah. Two song. Yeah. And so I merged. Want you gone and still alive together to still gone. Um, so we're coming up to. The last room, uh, the last level as well for Insomnia here. Yep. I had to climb through the vent because I normally like use the sound of the portal hitting to. Uh... Yeah, Insomnia has also been playing this game with no audio, which is completely my fault because I'm in charge of audio for this event. Uh, and so. yeah, 
And audio cues do play. Are we gonna, we might see the, the skip here by strafing or into this ground portal. Yeah. Strafe. It's it's pretty tough. Yeah, especially with unfamiliar like mouse territory here. Oh, nice. Oh, oh, nice. Nice. oh, oh nice. Nice. So, so you just got to get the momentum to get to the right side of the pole. Yep. And then, yeah. Well, that's looking and then good. Turn oh, oh. I think so. I think I hit. Yes. yes. That's a good shot. That's crazy. I I tried. Club who watched me on Discord trying to do that for about an hour. And I almost got it once. Fair it's tough. It, uh, trust me, I think I have the strats to help you. Yeah, you trained, <laughs> you taught me. Because I was watching the uh, video on the guide, and it's not quite like what you would it, but It's not quite. Basically, yeah, it's, it's, team, it's not one of my videos, so. <laughs> <laughs> and unless you're already quite familiar with uh, Source Engine, like air strafing and movement, yeah. it's quite unfamiliar because you do have to use air strafing, which is not an intuitive concept. At all, trying yeah, to get up I've, on the I've not of the ever room. played a Source game before. I'm primarily a JRPG runner, so you're, you're not used to running games under se seven hours. That oh, is, this is true. Oh, get it there. Nice. Yep, nice first one. So now we're really into the final boss fight for, for Insomnia, and this is going to be one of the the instant lock on strat. So if you stand in a specific spot here, that when the turret first pops up, it will instantly lock onto you. Um, so there is a little bit of waiting time here before the um, first rocket comes up again, or the La second, really. Lados is yapping away. Um, there is recently an even faster strat here, but I don't even do that. <laughs> it was after my time, even. Um, yeah. And I've only seen it in like two yeah. people's runs. The thing with, I think, is amazing about Portal speedrunning and speedrunning of every game is that even when you think, oh, we can't really get any better than this, we've optimized the game. There's always something. When I stopped playing this game, I think there was uh, the re record was like 16 minutes, and you're saying it's like 14 minutes now. Yeah. And at 16 minutes, people were fighting over like seconds and like milliseconds. The fact that we've gotten to two more minutes over a couple of years with brand new strats, who knows what's around the corner? Um, there were people that would say that were saying that sub 15 would never happen, and I was probably one of them. <laughs> um. So some runners famously said, world record isn't the goal, sub-15 is. And like, yeah. that, that was mad respect for them. That's like one of my favorite like, inspirational quotes ever. Huh? Uh, yeah, we've seen oh, it. you've got it there. You've already... Yeah. <laughs> the, um, do you know what the times are for the glitched runs? I don't know what the times are. Probably under like um, five minutes at this point. I don't have my phone on me. I, in, uh, out of bounds is high five, I think. High five. Oh, God. Um, no? High five. Yeah. <laughs> um, inbounds has gone down to um, low eight minutes. Vault skip did a lot for that. Yeah. Um, so, so vault skip is at the very start of the game. You saw us just standing in a room for one minute. Is that vault skip? Yeah. yeah. So basically, it's people like fifty something seconds. It's yeah. Like silly. Uh, you have to go in a different yeah. spot. Yeah. Well, if you don't get the instant lock on, the strat kind of falls apart, and you do have to move to a different area. But vault skip was found by a, a portal runner called Zionic. And yeah, that basically saves Ooh. you the 50 seconds of vault waiting time, which is kind of insane. The and as we're coming up to the end of the this race, this really good race, it was to and fro. Um, if anyone wants to get into speed running, this was my first speed game, and you just pick a time and you start going at it. So I'd highly recommend playing Portal as your first the, speed game. There's yeah, so many strats for so many different skill levels. It's yeah. A what very approachable <laughs> game. Very. The blue portal's a little bit too far back. Now it hits the railing, yeah. Cool. Let's hope that one hits. Yeah, nice, yeah, nice, nice. And uh, I'll, I'll mention the other run. So we've been making reference to the glitched runs, because this is a glitchless run. The two other major categories for this game is called inbounds and out of bounds, because you can go out of bounds and out of bounds, but in inbounds, your camera always has to stay within. Your camera and portals have to stay within. Yeah, the and, and the items point. on the level. That's and actually items. an important um, piece of knowledge now because there's new strats where you get a glitch state where items like can go crazy all over the map. Um, if, if you watch uh, the any percent of out of bounds, uh, uh, once I we get the portal gun, nothing makes sense anymore <laughs> because <laughs> of these uh, weird strats called. Is a save glitch? Yeah. Yeah, save glitch where you disconnect your camera from where you're shooting from or something like that, or where your player location. PH, like, 
the, like papers have been written about. Yeah, how the there has work. been a multiple page length Google Doc <laughs> file that you can read up and that sort of stuff. Um, it's a very like hard one to understand completely. But we've got insomnia coming up on the end very soon. As soon as this last core is disintegrated and the crosshair disappears. So we're almost there. Um, ooh, ooh. In a bit of an awkward position ooh. there. Oh, not quite. Oh, so the like collision on the uh, the railing is yeah. like off just a little bit. Yeah, All right. and it's You're just stuffed us. The, the, the core angle. runs it's like grr, grr, and <laughs> yeah. Yeah, the reason I couldn't make that one was because I didn't hear the ro like rocket launching. Yeah, because there's no audio. And like I couldn't see the laser because it's like so tight on that first one that it just doesn't even and show up. And that is time. time. <laughs> So yeah, good run both of you. I think fantastic like, runs. Things go wrong. Like we're not unfamiliar here, but <laughs> not the, not perfect setup. I think as well. you showed off a lot of things, and then I'm kind of impressed that we had two different routes here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I very yeah. much cool. went for safe. The, yeah, not as risky stuff. Insomnia definitely has a better PB than myself. But on like, it's it's, the riskiest it's cool to show off different things yeah, here. Yeah, 100. So I think that'll do it for us. That'll do it for us. Yep. Stick around. We've got all speedruns all weekend. So uh, donate at ozspeedruns.com and uh, enjoy packs. Thanks for having me. Bye. Thank you, Sayo and Insomnia, for that fantastic run. Up next, we have Super Mario 3D World and Bowser's Fury. Bowser's Fury Any Percent by Grub Dog. And we do have a few donations that came through for that run. We have $25 from Chewy that says, Glad to support a good cause. Very awesome matching donations. Good luck, Portal Runners. And we also have $20 from Kate Latte that says, May the best Portal win. Incentive towards Janitor's Choice for Control, please. Just as a reminder, if you would like to donate uh, for game on cancer we do have qr codes around the stage here on site as well as an in cash donation jar or you can go to donate.ozspeedruns.com uh, if you want to include a donation incentive in that please be sure it's in the message uh, and any donations uh, currently will still be matched uh, for double the value up until uh, 5,000 mark uh, all weekend long by bear with a shotgun thank you so much Set up. We do have a couple more donations. We have $50 from McNeg uh, with no comment. We have $20 from Abski with no comment as well. Thank you all so much for your generous donations. Thank you.
Alrighty, up next we have Bowser's Fury Any Percent by Grub Dog. Stick around, that's coming up right now. Take it away.